we are beginning quantum physics, and so we're going to do kind of a, a two-part development for quantum physics. The first section, we're going to talk more about the, the foundations, and you know, we're, we're going to focus at least largely on the experimental basis for why we need quantum physics to, to begin with here. And then we're going to, as we develop it further, we're going to get into some more, some more of the mathematical intricacies of what quantum physics involves. And this is where we see the, the Schrodinger equation, the Heisenberg uncertainty principle, um, all that, you know, kind of famous stuff that you've hopefully heard about before. But um, we're going to begin today, at least with, first of all, just, you know, number one, what is relativity? Like, sorry, what is uh, quantum physics? What's it all about? And what are the, and by the way, I use quantum physics and quantum mechanics completely interchangeably. Yeah, you could be a little bit of a semanticist and, and, you know, worry about the difference, but don't, it's the same thing to me. So, uh, we're going to talk about, like, what are the basic tenets, and why does that screw with our brains, kind of? And then I do want to give a, you know, a historically more or less kind of correct, um, you know, rendition of how we arrived at our understanding for when, for example, um, Einstein, Niels Bohr, Heisenberg, Max Born, others developed that theory of, of quantum physics that we're going to learn about. So it's, it's kind of a fun, it's more, a much more of a narrative kind of discussion today, but that's, you know, I, I want to get to some of the heart of um, what are some of those weird oddities that the, the quantum world, you know, poses when we start thinking too hard about it, uh, is one way to put it. So um, let's go ahead and get started on, on the first section here, just what is quantum physics? 